tell you all for today's video I am going to be showing you some of my first projects that I made so right here I have this t-shirt um, this was actually my first time making a t-shirt so we have a rib knit here and I use this cheetah print fabric I hemmed the bottom and I actually did a catch stitch for the inside so that is this this is actually one of my favorite t-shirts ever so this is another garment I made it's like a sweetheart top um, I actually made this with no dress form so I actually freestyled on this and I did like flat pattern making techniques for this sweetheart top and um, I started selling these on Etsy so when I opened my shop on Etsy I was selling sweetheart tops like this made with like corduroy material, jean material and other stuff and they actually did pretty well as far as sales on Etsy so I, I would try this on but I don't think I could fit it <laughs> alright so I have these vests here I don't even know if I can fit them but I'm going to try it on <laughs> okay this one fit a little better than the blue one here so this is like a halter top um, vest and it does have little hooks and eyes so that you can hook it and I think I'm able to so when I first started sewing um, I made so many of these vests and um, the person that helped me was Tamisha Glazian she has a channel on YouTube called do it yourself Misha and as you guys know she has passed away a couple years ago but she's the one who showed me how to make a vest and add lining to it so um, the first vest I made I believe I had one of my models wear it and we did a photo shoot in it so I'm going to show you guys that picture on the screen right here so that was my first ever vest right here and then this one is made with like a type of brocade silk fabric and then I have lining in the inside and I did try this on this is like way too small <laughs> and this shirt right here is my first ever button-up shirt so what I did here was I did a slip stitch for the collar and then the buttonholes I just did buttons right here and then right here I didn't even do this right like I didn't even use a buttonhole machine I tried to do it with my hand because I was pressed for time and then this fabric is cotton and what I did was I used two different color fabrics but the prints are the same and then of course I hemmed the bottom and stuff like that so that is pretty much it for this shirt and I think that's all that I found in my closet for as far as like the first garments that I've ever made and also you guys I have a tutorial for this wrap shirt with the skirt so with this skirt it has like an invisible um, I call it a visible elastic so you can't see that it has elastic in it so make sure you guys check out that tutorial I'm gonna leave the link down below in the description other than that, thank you guys for watching. If you haven't already, make sure to join my sewing group on Facebook, which is called Sewing to Fashion. Um, I'm going to leave that link down below, so make sure you join. Other than that, thank you guys for watching. Bye. Hey, you make me feel like a rebel, but I will not give you hope.